All right. Thank you so much for joining me. We're going to begin today's um, class by starting to just uh, become part of the present moment by following the breath and noticing the way the breath connects to the body. This is going to help us to reduce some stress. And most of this class is actually going to focus on stress reduction, relaxing the body, but then also restoring it with positivity, some kind of emotion or feeling of gratitude or an attitude that supports you and the best you throughout the day. We're going to begin by connecting to our breath. And the way we want to obtain this present moment understanding is by knowing that we breathe in and breathe out in a way that can only support the present moment. Breathe in. Notice the inhale. Notice the breath. And then breathe out, releasing the breath. Now, this breath is only accessible right now. Your in-breath in this moment can only be in this moment. And your out-breath in this moment can only be in this moment. You cannot breathe this breath into the future. And you cannot breathe in a breath from the past. So each breath that you experience when you're aware of it connects you to the present, the truth of the present moment, the right here, the right now. And we're going to start to bring that uh, idea of the present moment and breath down into our feet body. And just start to notice the way the breath maybe connects. You don't have to bring your um, breath to your feet right away. Allow yourself some time to just settle in. Allowing for the inhale and exhale and the cycle of breath to come in its own time. And for the next five cycles of breath, just continue to try to bring that breath in your mind's eye, allowing it to touch your feet. Think about the way your feet feel. And just try to experience that feeling. And think about how the breath arrives at the feet. And then just let it go. And try to just be present with the feet and the breath. Now, as you're doing this practice, various thoughts might come to mind, and that's common. But just become like an observer of these thoughts and continue to focus on the breath, and being aware of where you want it to go. And try to focus more on that direction and the breath more than the thoughts that might arise. And if any negative thought comes to mind that's dominant, I want you to greet it with love. Again, from the standpoint as an observer, You don't have to agree. You don't have to feed into it. 
but any dominant thoughts for that matter you can greet with love. And see if you can allow love to be part of this practice. On your next inhale in, feel love travel with the breath down into the feet body. And on the exhale, give yourself the opportunity to relax. Relax in love and feel completely supported. Inhaling and exhaling. Continue to keep in your mind's eye the sense of love on your feet. And just allow it to be part of your present. No need to do anything, no requirement for it to be there. And just allow your breath to help you stay anchored and grounded in love. And maybe you can relax just a little bit more. Inviting love to replace tension. Inviting love to replace stress. Just for this moment. We're going to start to rise up from our feet bringing with us our breath, our inhale completely fills the legs from the lowest part of the ankle all the way to the top of the hips, it wraps around filling each part of the leg body and each cell with love and on the exhale, relaxing so that the legs can renew. The legs can feel supported in love. And for the next five breath cycles, allow yourself to just go through this process of bringing your breath consistently to the legs, exploring them, and then on the exhale, releasing any stress or tension so that love can then replace it. Again, should any thoughts arise that dominate and distract or are negative, greet them with your love. Focus more on love. Anchoring through the breath in the present moment to the love that exists inside of you through each inhale and exhale. Completely supported. And maybe even allow anything that is tense or any stress to just fall away. Maybe in your mind's eye you can imagine it just falling away off the legs. 
and fall every single part. Maybe the skin even relaxes a little bit, allowing a sense of support from the air around it. And just know there's nothing that you have to do to be worthy of this love that is already here in your present inside of you through each breath in and out. Inhale is going to allow us permission to rise up into the mid part of the body. From the lowest part of the hips, where the pelvic bowl is, the sits bone, up the spine, the full length of the back, and then wrapping around to the belly the chest, the rib cage, the heart. And as you breathe in, allow the breath to fill up the belly, the chest, the back body. Just notice how it rises. And on the exhale, release. Just notice how it releases. On your next inhale, allow that same present moment experience to help carry the sense of love through each part of your heart, belly, back, chest, body. And on the exhale, allow for anything that doesn't serve you in this moment to fall away. Thoughts, emotions, Anything dominant that distracts. Just continue to come back to the breath in the present moment. And then let it be connected to love as you know it. And just knowing that your breathing can be enough. Knowing that you showed up here is enough. It doesn't have to be what love looks like to the rest of the world. It's just where you are right now. And that's okay, accepting that. And take about five breath cycles to allow this love to permeate throughout the full length of the mid body. Maybe even smile, letting it be one breath at a time. And try to allow yourself to merge here completely in the present moment, aware of how you're engaging your breath and the intentionality of placing love into your breath cycle as you focus on the body, scanning up, all the way to the shoulders.
next we're going to let the breath guide us to our arms, the full length of our limbs from the left to the right. And as your breath acts as a guide, follow it from the shoulders, wrapping around the biceps and the triceps through the arms, the forearm, the elbow, to the wrists and the fingertips. And really feel your hands, feeling the knuckle of the palm, the inside area of the palm. Notice the coolness or the temperature that your hands hold at this moment. And see if you can just bring love all the way to each part of your hands, arms, every joint in your arm body. Knowing that these hands serve and work daily. Knowing that these hands can hold other hands and support one another. Just for a moment, allow that to rise up through your breath. knowing that these hands can not just support, but they also connect to other, other people in this world. And you can do that with love. So this is the time to allow them to restore, relax, maybe a little bit more letting go of anything that doesn't serve you, including tension or stress, giving your arms permission to relax. And through your inhale, restore and fill up with love. And on the exhale, let go just a little bit more to make room. And if your mind wanders, gently bring them back to your hands. Each inhale and exhale. Remembering that we can only focus on the inhale in this moment. And the exhale in this moment. One breath at a time. Our next breath in, we can just connect to the next part of our body, which is our neck body. And just feel the breath travel through the throat. Notice the inner, the outer neck, the back, where the bones are, the front, which is softer to touch more delicate and fragile. And just for a moment, allow your voice to be part of this practice. And let the breath fill it up with love. And on the exhale, release any worry, stress, or tension that may have come out through your voice and through your words. Just for this moment, continue to focus on love, that caring, supporting, well-being that comes with being in love. 
that faith, that determination and courage that comes from being in love. And whatever else comes from being in love and loving yourself, just for a few moments, about five breath cycles, fill your voice up with what that's like when you are truly resting in love through each breath. And we're going to have the breath travel up now through the face. Completely embodying the face with each inhale. Notice the eyes, the cheeks, the nose. See for a moment if you can just relax them, allowing any stress or worry to peel away any thoughts or deceptions of what your appearance should or shouldn't be to be something that releases on the exhale and on the inhale love fills up the full face structure bones and body and each inhale and exhale allow you to stay present completely aware of your face and the love that is connecting to each cell in the face body. And maybe relax the eyes a little bit more, knowing that they're greeted with the sense of love and heartfulness. Relax the tongue from the top of the mouth, relax the jaw, Nothing to clench onto or hold on to. Knowing that we're made perfect in this love, just as we are. And for the next few moments, continue to just sit within the sense of love for your face. Each inhale and exhale serving this purpose in the present moment so that you're completely aware, completely in truth. Our next inhale, we're going to rise up to the crown of our head, 
that beautiful crown that shines bright and genuinely. That beautiful crown that connects to the sun when the sun beats down. You can feel the warmth at the top of the head. Or if it's cool, you can feel the coolness here. Nonetheless, allow your breath to travel through the head body. And notice any thoughts that might be in this part, particularly your mind. And as an observer, just step back for a moment and allow the breath to fill up the mind completely in the present moment with the inhale in and on the exhale, releasing anything that does not serve you in this moment, peeling away at the stress, the worry, anxiety, letting it all go just for this moment on the exhale. And on the next inhale, filling it with love and thoughts that support love and energy that supports thoughts of love. And then also physically, treating your mind in a way that you love it. Not just using it, but giving it whatever it needs in this moment to restore and to feel love. And on the exhale, letting go of anything that doesn't necessarily need to be here right now or any thoughts that are dominant, damaging. Completely let them go right now and never have to look at them again. And continue to just be here with your mind the crown of your head, breathing in love and exhaling and releasing things that don't necessarily belong here. Allow yourself to restore. On the next inhale, we're going to allow this breath now to travel the full length of the body, reflecting as we breathe in, all the way from the crown of the head down to the toes, and on the exhale, continuing to stabilize here in the present moment as we let go of anything final that doesn't serve this part of the practice opening ourselves up to restore for the remainder of the practice, restoring with love and any other emotion or feeling or sense of being. Allow yourself to welcome it, knowing that that's part of self-love. That's part of being human, that's part of life. Continue to inhale and exhale, remaining completely present in truth, your truth. I'm going to read a quote today. And this quote is, As soon as he has considered the origin and destruction of the elements of the body, he finds happiness and joy which belongs to those who know the immortal 
or the nirvana. This comes from the book of the teachings of the Buddha. It's a nice little quote to take with us. I'm going to ring the singing bowl and just allow it to be part of your practice as we start to wind down. Welcome to continue to meditate as long as you like by leaving this session now. Otherwise, we will close together. As you begin to refocus on the present around you, you can start to wiggle your toes. Maybe your hands as well. Gently allow some light to come into your eyes and refixate your gaze. Breathing in and out. You can take all part or none of this uh, practice with you today. As you hope everything that you do is filled with love. You have a beautiful love to share with the world. I thank you so much for joining me today and namaste. Thank you.